Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Desperados 3 on the PlayStation 4 Pro. So a couple things before we start here. First of all, it seems that the challenges are not those star things, because if you click on the challenges, this is the Baron's challenges. The Baron waits in the shadows who contact you in the time is right. I think Ooh. that's something else. Oh, oops. Okay, so you can click on it here. Those are the badges. That's what they're called. All right, interesting. And then the other thing is I was thinking about how we could have killed her with the poison. I think we would have had to go downstairs and go behind the bar and then poison whatever drink she was bringing up. Because you can't really talk to civilians, so it's not like we'd have a conversation True. with her. Like, hey, I know you hate this bitch. Put this in her drink. Well, remember that, that bottle that we picked up? Yeah. Yeah, I think that yeah, he said that was a poison, so we could have walked down. And then, so you have to go black both upstairs and downstairs yeah. to do that objective. It's quite challenging. Yeah, just shoot her. <laughs> yeah, it was easier to shoot her. And there's actually one more thing, and that is the fact that there will not be a video on Sunday or on Monday. And that is because, as many of you guys may know, Sunday is Father's Day. And I do work all day on Saturday and Sunday, uh, so we will not be celebrating that on you Sunday. I don't work on Saturday. Oh, I don't work on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I work all day on Sunday. I'm all confused here. Uh, happy Father's Day to all of you fathers out there, or fathers-to-be. Uh, happy Daddy's Day. Hope you guys have an awesome day. Uh, but again, I do work all day on, on Sunday. Uh, just on Sunday, I'm off on Saturday. And so that's when we're going to celebrate uh, Father's Day, is on Saturday. Kick back and chill. Yeah, kick back and chill. Uh, so the kids did get me a present. I got delivered to the house. It was a big old, awesome. it's a big old box. I don't know what it is, but I'm really curious to see what it is. Uh, so they did give me a, a, a gift. But in addition to that, the, the main thing I, I really wanted was to just be able to like kick back all day and play some video games. Uh, just kind of close the door to our office, you know, cause you know, I'm going to be playing as many of you guys may be playing this weekend. The last of us two came out on father's day. It does seem like that was kind of strategic that yeah. release. <laughs> uh, so that's coming out, that came out Friday. So we've got it pre-ordered. I'm gonna pick it up on Friday. And then the plan is to play it all day on Saturday. I'm just gonna play it from the point I get up until the point I go to sleep. <laughs> to try and make as much progress as possible. Uh, Cause yeah, these days it's so hard for me to play any video oh, games, I man. Know. Like it takes me like six months to, to beat a game. Uh, you know, like a regular old 30 hour, 40 hour game or whatever, because that's how long games typically are and these days. you gotta keep at it, because if you go too long without playing it, you're like, God damn. Yeah, you forget what you're doing, what, what's happening in the story. It seems to happen to me quite a bit. Uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna be playing that all day on Saturday. So we're not gonna be doing any recordings for Sunday. Uh, so that's the reason why there won't be a Sunday video. And then of course, because I work all day on Sunday, we don't typically have videos on Monday uh, for those of you who happen to be new to our channel. Uh, so we will see you guys on Tuesday. That'll be when the next episode comes out. Uh, so this one's gonna be the Higgins Estate. And you can't, it's interesting that you can't see the, uh, uh, the, the badges until after you've completed it. So the idea here is that you gotta redo stuff if you really yeah. wanna. So you can go mm -hmm. back and tailor your own experience. Yeah, so this is the man they call Frank is at the estate of Mayor Higgins. Okay, so he's not the mayor. John Cooper heads over not knowing that a certain someone is getting ready for her wedding there. A certain someone. Someone is getting married. All right. So we're going to plan this one. Let's go to read this. Half hour, round up the, uh, half, half hour ride up the mountain from Flagstone lies the newly built estate of Mayor Higgins. Having come to considerable wealth after certain deals with the Devitt Company, Higgins has spared no expense to outfit his outfit his humble abode with the latest comforts and luxuries. Recently, the entire estate has been busy with wedding preparations. Mayor Higgins, after years of rebuke, has finally convinced the love of his life to tie the knot. Unbeknownst to him, however, the bride has her own plans for the big day. I just had you read the whole thing. I can't read today. Until death do you part. I'm tired, Swiftly. guys. Swiftly. <laughs> we worked out tonight. Oh my god. And it was a hell of a workout. Yeah. Everyone hold still, please. Magnificent. And another. I think this side is much more stable. I'll fetch another plate. Right. How do you like the new dress, sweet pea? It's a lovely, darling. Oh, 
excellent. I want everyone talking about this day for years. Mayor Higgins. Oh, what now? Frank says he's getting impatient. Shh, not now. Can't you see we're in the middle of something? I'm sorry, sweet pea. This is something I really have to take care of. Don't you worry about me, darling. Oh, okay, stay right here. I I'll be back in a jiffy. I need more time. Try to distract Frank. I really need to check the flower arrangements. Yes, sir. <sighs> Bye for now. Finally, I thought he'd never leave. Need to work fast, get what I need, and leave before I get dragged to the altar. First, I need a key to the upper floor. I think she carries a spare. Bet she won't mind if I borrow it for a spell. The guards won't bother me so long as I don't misbehave too much. As soon as I get it, I'll sneak in through the library door. The upper floor is off limits. I'll have to avoid the guards until I reach the office. I'll turn the place upside down until I find what I'm here for. All right then. I need to get out of here before the groom decides to check in on his bride. Okay, so we're playing as the third character that we get. Or I guess it's the fourth character since we already did play as that one guy who we get, I, I, we get back at some point later. I I assume one thing. soon. The dress is beautiful. It is a beautiful dress. <laughs> Uh, so we should probably take a look at her and her abilities. Uh, she got nothing. So she can't swim either. Uh, she can only drag the single body and can only climb ladders. Uh, not too surprising considering the fact that she is in a dress. Well, she uh, she has a kick. She can knock out yeah. enemies at close range. So I assume we don't have all her abilities yet. Because uh, we're, we're in a wedding dress. Uh, so let's go ahead and head on over to that character that we needed to steal from. She's really fast, Yeah, for being in a dress, she's pretty damn quick. Uh, so now we learn how to pickpocket. In certain missions, Kate can pickpocket enemies, but be careful if you're spotted doing so, sound the alarm. Step close to the target and use the X to pickpocket. Oh, so we gotta pickpocket the key. Mm -hmm. And then perfume vials. Kate has an unlimited supply of perfume vials. One vial temporarily blinds all guards in range. This is one of the few abilities that has its full effect on all guard types including long coats and ponchos. So yeah, she's just uh, ridiculously powerful, it seems. No one can resist. Can anybody see us? I don't think so. Um, you have to be in the sneak mode? How do you pickpocket again? Knock up or maybe pick up? Oh, you didn't see nothing. All right, so basically we gotta do this in the squat over there where she was first standing. Unless she goes somewhere else. Yeah, we're just gonna have to wait nice. since we don't want to take that guy out. Let's go to quick save. Poncho, man. Mm -hmm. So we'd like if she goes right here, then we can squat right here and pickpocket. If you can pickpocket while squatted, huh? This might be trickier than I thought. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> How do you... Okay, I see. We, we're going to have to use the perfume vial on him. On him. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's what it comes down to. So we had to blind him. Oh, it makes me sneeze. <laughs> we should probably do it... I don't know if it matters if we do it while she's looking at us. All right. And... He ain't seeing shit. There we go. We did it, guys. Got it. So we got the key. Question is, can we go in here without uh, issue? I don't see anybody looking at us. No, I mean, once we walk oh. past this, this is going to be a blocked area. I don't know. She just said the, the upstairs is off limits. Okay, so we should be okay in here, hopefully. I guess we'll find out. We just quick saved it. We'll see if anybody gives a shit. Okay, so nobody gives a shit. So we need to get into there. There's a ladder. Can... I assume this guy here won't be able to see us no. up there. So what if we like get Judy into our Chapman. squat and then Judy chop him? Nope, that's not gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, good thing we uh 
quick saved. I don't think we quick saved after the door. Oh, yeah, we quick saved. Okay. Yep, I got this, Jinx. So we need okay, to take this guy out. out first. And she knocks him out a little bit differently. <laughs> a kick to the dick. So what do you do to like There's the door. <laughs> keep him knocked out? True. I guess we re knock him out again. <laughs> yeah, there's no. She doesn't have a she weapon. Didn't kill oh, hold up! Wait a minute. Well, she doesn't have a weapon right now. Oh, she I might see. kill him later. A timer. Yep. Come on, come on, knock him out. Hurry. And then we'll read this real quick. That seems important. Kate only knocks out guards and has no lethal takedown. Oh. Oh, she also doesn't carry any rope to tie them up. So be careful; they'll wake up again. So she does have her weaknesses. We got this. We have plenty of time, Jinx. Plenty of time. All right, so we're in. I don't know why it takes her so long to use a key. I know. We should probably quick save this shit now that we're in. Well, is it a whole keychain that she's trying to dig? Trying, maybe, perhaps. Uh, I think we can hide in that cupboard right oh, there. Oh yeah, maybe. If need be. Uh oh. Yeah, but they're not gonna come in here. I don't think. And I don't you think they can think see not. in here either. No, it doesn't look like he can see in there. All right, so to get to there, we have to get past this guy. All right, so let's see how the best way to go about doing this would be. Two failures. So you got the gunman here. They talk to each other. I mean, he could hide in there, but I'm not seeing any reason to hide just yet. I think the better way to do it would be to just let him go by and then knock him out while he's turned the other way. Which way is he gonna turn though? Doesn't matter. We got him, Jinx. And then we're gonna hide him in the I cupboard. Knock him out for a while. Okay. Oh, I thought he punched you. Alright, so we'll hide him in this little cupboard here. He won't stay hidden for long. It's gonna be funny seeing him crawl out of there. True. He's gonna be like, what the hell? So we can probably just avoid knocking this guy out, I think. I don't think it's really necessary to knock him out. Yeah. Alright. In Almost the door? There. And, now to find and voila, papers. look at this. Almost there. Alright, so let's go and look for this. It must be here somewhere. Oh shit. found my office. You should keep your friends waiting, Hagen. Eh, well, sorry about that. The wedding, you understand. Of course. Eh, there's the food, the decorations, the blast. Let's get this done. I got a train to catch. Of course. Just give me a moment. Did I hear correctly? There was trouble in Flagstone yesterday. The usual. I can imagine Mr. DeVitt isn't too happy about that. DeVitt isn't here. I wonder if he'd want you to leave things unfinished here. Or is there something more important in New Orleans? <laughs> Maybe you should just get back to your wedding, Higgins. Maybe you're right. Wouldn't want the bride to get nervous. Well, she has every reason to be. Pardon? I don't think she'll be happy when she finds out you sold off her family ranch. Well, she doesn't have to find out until after the wedding, right? <laughs> you know... I don't think it will make much difference in the end. Enjoy your wedding, Higgins. 
Hey, wait a second. I need a drink. Sure you want to do this alone? This ain't a discussion. So, what's your plan? Get in, find Frank, do what I came for. March through the front gate. There's a path down those cliffs. I'll just follow that and climb up those vines. From there, I'll wing it. That's no plan, amigo. I've pulled off flimsier ones. If I think something's up, I'll come and get you. No, you stay put. This is my fight. <sighs> Whatever you say, amigo. Alright, so no Hector in this one. That's fine, we've kind of gotten used to just rolling on our own. Yeah, are these all bad guys? These are all bad guys. But I assume they don't give a shit if I go behind them. Like, whatever, I'm just gonna go take a piss in the woods mm -hmm. here. Yep, and so now we're in the area that we need to be concerned about. Mm. We just need to get back up into the bushes. And then we'll quick save that shit. Alright, uh, so uh, we might not even take anybody out, honestly. Oh, nope, nope, there's that guy there. Never mind, good thing we quick saved. I didn't even see that guy. I probably should have checked. If we ever get like a big house, we're not putting bushes everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Too many places for, for uh, sneaky people to, to hide. But getting sneaky peats. Mm-hmm. Of course, it's never as easy as you assume it would be. We're going to have to use our coin. Why are people not petting those ponies oh, is what I want to know. I don't know, Jinx. I throw a coin over there, and then motherfuckers will look. What's that noise? Mm hmm because they want to know. It's the Monopoly Man. <laughs> and then we'll go up this way. Can you go all the way around? It looks like you can. Yeah, I don't know if that dude looking down can see, though. He might How be able to see. Can. It seems like he can see. But there is a little area up along the wall. I wonder if he can chuck a knife at him. I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Let's go yeah, quick save. I don't know. He can't oh. see. It was good to see if he could. But Maybe yeah. Mm-hmm. It'll be tricky getting through there. I mean, you can get to the bush. I just don't know if he can see along the wall. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, it looks like he can. Guess luckily there's a bush. I think that there's that little zone he that can't tiny see there. Sliver. Yeah, right there. Oh. See? We got this, Jinx. Maybe. Hey, you. <laughs> okay, so you gotta run once you get that point. You just don't have enough time. Okay. Trial and error, guys. Trial and error. Alright, let's we back toss into the, the coin up. We oh. probably could, I suppose, but we've already figured this out. Oh, he saw me. I'm a little surprised he was there. He must have seen my hat sticking out or something. He is serious about his duty. Mm hmm. He ain't playing. All right, so we wait till him go by and then run. <laughs> <laughs> All right, awesome. So, so let's quick save it. Are we so close? It seems like we got a long way to go, Jinx, oh. with a lot of dudes in between yeah. us and the end here. I thought we were like going up in a way, not oh, oh, up no. and around. So the first guy is this guy. So we can go into the bush here. Yeah, that's the way we'll do it. Get into the bush, but now we're gonna have to use the coin. I don't see any other way to to distract this guy or to uh to get through here. Uh, so let's go ahead. You could knife him. I just need a few seconds. Maybe. I could, but how do we get up there to get the knife back? Oh, true. It'd probably just be easier to throw the coin and get him to look back. Ah. Oh, that didn't work. Oh. Damn. We weren't it's close enough. Hard. Uh -huh. <laughs> what did he say, Jinx? You know what he said. I don't know what he said, actually. Everybody heard him. 
I need you to say it for me, Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I didn't realize we couldn't I toss the coin from there. I think that dude is drunk. Hmm. There we go. You hear that? All right, so now he's looking. So did you hear that? Sound like money. And it's timed perfectly, guys. Should quick say. He should have, but it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me. Don't mind me. <laughs> yeah, we'll just hide in the bushes and wait dun, this thing dun, out. Dun, dun, dun. It goes down. <laughs> and then we go Destroy over here. Destroy the tables. And then we do a shootout, fellas. Poisonous stew. Execute plan. <laughs> yeah, we just gonna kill everybody. <laughs> Uh, I had to take some people down with me this time, guys. All right, we are doing a terrible job with the quick saving. All right, so let's do this again. And this time, let's try our best I just need to not to get caught. Yeah. So easy. <laughs> well, if we take this guy out now. Yeah. Uh. You didn't see shit. Get off of me. <laughs> it's just not, we're just not moving quick enough. I know, he's so slow. He's like, I'm gonna grab you, and then I'm gonna stab you, and then I'm gonna do a little jig on mm -hmm. your body. <laughs> <laughs> so that everybody knows oh, that I did it. Few seconds. It's Cooper's signature uh -huh. move. Oh, now he's turned. It's What's called that? the Cooper Groove. Oh. Hey now. Fucking dick. Feels like... <laughs> We're through here, right? Not really. The alarm is sound. Yeah, that means there's gonna be more guys. A lot more guys. No more surprises. No more surprises. <laughs> I'd say fuck it. Who cares if the alarm is set? It doesn't matter. We're not gonna do this shit perfect every damn time. You guys are watching Praetorian hijinks. I don't know where you thought you were. Uh, but <laughs> this is not the channel where we do everything perfect but and you optimally. Said pro. <laughs> <laughs> it is r really actually quite funny just how many people get confused by that. They they I think they look up, you know, pro level gameplay and then, you know, they get get our gameplay cuz we are playing on the PS4 Pro. Oh, I didn't know there's a little way you could go through here so we could have got our knife back. Mm, yeah. I didn't even see that there. Oh, well. It doesn't matter. It is what it is. So now we've got these three patrolling around. So this is why you typically don't want to set the oh, alarm I off. Because then you get like tricky shit like that. So now we, we've got to figure out how to get past all these dudes. All the dudes. So we can coin, put a coin right there on that guy. What is the little check mark? Knife mean? this guy over here. I think that means you listen to his conversation. Oh. Okay. You see how it said eavesdrop on, yeah. on the conversations? I forgot we could do that. Yeah, I think that's what was going on there. All right, I feel like we got this. We just got to, like, do this smart, Jinx. Yeah, just like, you know. Oh, no, not that smart. That ain't smart. <laughs> that wasn't smart at all. We did quick save, right? Yeah. I feel like we did. I think we're still in the bush. Yeah, we're in the bush. Okay. Okay, so again, we need to throw the coin. Anybody find anything? Over that away. Need to bounce it off his eyeballs. What we need to do. So we'll throw the coin right there. Damn it! To get him to turn Looks around. Like here no more. All right. New plan. Frank done left. And find out he where Frank went. stick around for wedding cake. Mm-hmm. I want some wedding cake. Oh, me too, man. I'd eat the shit out of some wedding cake right about now. All right, so we're in there. There's a dude right there. Yeah, I know. I was going to stab him. But it didn't work. <laughs> ah, ha, ha, ha. Don't, Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'm in a bush. You didn't see shit. <laughs> That's their alarm? <laughs> He's like, I know you're in there. You ain't no Barry. <laughs> huh. What if we threw the knife at him instead of walked up? I mean, they might see it. Ooh. But they already set the alarm off. I mean, how many more dudes could come, right? And we'll be inside. What's the Sold matter? All the dudes. I think we got this, guys. Damn it. Sounds like Frank ain't here no more. All right. 
New plan. Could so that's what we found out find from. And find out where Frank went. Oh, I see. That was their conversation uh -huh. with Frank left. Yeah. You didn't yeah. see what? How do you see me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, try again, guys. Try, try, try again. I'm surprised he was able to see me like uh, so I quickly. Know. He recognized you. These guys are hiding good. <laughs> are we? Sure doesn't feel like we are. <laughs> All right, let's put that there. Oh, that dude. Oh, okay. Maybe he saw us. <laughs> Yeah, there's just so many dudes. Yeah, through that little sliver. Well, no, because he wasn't there when we went through here. No, it seems like those dudes are, are moving around all over the damn mm -hmm. place. So these are the uh, gunmen. All right, so we'll have to do this. we got to wait for these guys to go, basically. Damn it. Sounds like Frank Wait for him to gather. All right. Yeah, wait for him to go over that way. Fine, man. <laughs> he walked by. I couldn't it's help myself. So slow. <laughs> it's like the slowest kill ever. Look at you. I'm uh -huh. gonna stab you. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't help myself, guys. He was like right there, just begging to be killed. You're just a serial killer. That's mm -hmm. all. Well, he's right in the bushes. He literally James. like tripped on you. <laughs> I know. I don't know. I didn't see us. Sounds like Frank ain't here no more. All right, new play. All right, let's try this again, guys. And find out. Let's save it right here, Frank. by the way. Oh, it's a new plan. What the hell? What the hell? All right, and then we're gonna throw the knife. You'll probably see this, but who gives a shit? Oh, okay. There's a guy up there who sees that shit too. Oh, that guy over there in the mm -hmm. corner that there's no way we could have known was over there. Damn, Frank went. All right, so we have to like get through here. Oh, fuck. I'm not entirely sure how we're gonna do this, guys. Yeah. Oh shit. <sighs> yeah. This guy's died so many times. How do these hmm. people know we're not a wedding guest? Where Frank went. I know, right? There's nothing to say. They don't even give us the opportunity to be like, oh, I was looking for the bathroom. So I could powder my nose. You didn't see shit. I'm in the bush. <laughs> All right. So I feel, in there. I feel like we're safe, Jinx. Poncho man's going to get you. You ain't seen shit. We're in the bush, Jinx. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he said, I see you at home. <laughs> <laughs> think you can just sneak around. Good God, guys. Yeah, this game is really tough, man. It is ridiculous. Uh-huh. I've never been, like, a huge fan of stealth games. Like, I like Metal Gear Solid, and that's a stealth game. But, yeah, if I'm being honest, I'm not, like, a massive fan. I absolutely hate stealth games. Unless they give you, like, the option, because they know you're going to fuck up uh -huh. and not be stealthy. Oh, no. I'm coming in. All right, put all that all right so he went in there. <laughs> yeah, you can't hide in there. It's too damn yeah. close. Okay, so I got a new plan, guys. <laughs> We're just going to keep on doing this. Like, hear me out. I got this, guys. I know what's going on. Don't judge me. Like, Call I me a like shitty like gamer. I like good at stealth games. I'm just not. I get too impatient. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought I could do it. What the hell, Poncho Man? Oh, we lost interest. <laughs> oh, they're gonna go in that bush right there. And we ain't got our knife. Oh, Poncho Man. Oh, Poncho Man. Dick. <laughs> we gotta kill huh. all the ponchos. Okay, so clearly this plan is not working, guys. We're frank. We have to take those guys out. I'm not sure how to go about doing it. Do they ever separate from each other? Are these butt buddies that are always together? We're the best as pals. always be together. I mean, yeah, if they're Until like... Until a lady comes along and then we're going to kill No, I was thinking they were a couple. Look at like the way they're looking tell. at each other. With that twinkle in their the eye. The back mountain shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Oh, yeah. He's mm -hmm. getting a little... 
Look at him thrusting oh, his hip look at him. At him. They need They're him thrusting hybrid. their hips at each other, man. <laughs> this is what's gonna go down in the room later, man. This is a very you guys get accepting a mm -hmm. Western times we got here. Well, you see they're hiding it. They're not doing it in the open. Whatever. I mean we see oh, it. True. We see it, but does everybody else? Uh it's kinda hard to miss two two dicks touching <laughs> tips. <laughs> uh, maybe it is a very accepting place. We don't maybe. know. So it does feel like they're just gonna twinkle at each other for <laughs> Poor the whole thing, time, which in that case, I don't really know how you're supposed to get past those guys. I guess you just shoot them both. I suppose we can start dealing with these guys next. Deal with the poncho guy first. Uh, can we get past these guys though? I guess that's the question. What we need to do is knock out that maid lady, uh -huh. steal her dress, and then we can just walk around. Cooper doesn't get in dresses, Jinx. He sure does. All right, so we're past them. So now we're gonna go kill the Poncho dude. After those guys are gone, we'll kill Poncho man, and we'll need our our knife for that. So kill Poncho man. We'll kill that guy, and we'll just take them all out. Fuck just it. This whole everybody's everyone. gonna die. Do we need to quick save? Yes. I should have probably tried to do something different. I tried that one so many times because I just would not <laughs> give up on it. Who needs <laughs> oh, they saw that too. <laughs> They're like, "What the hell?" I didn't man think they would. Man? I didn't think they would see that, honestly. I didn't either. But I didn't even bother to check if he could see him, which we he can. We overestimated the twinkle. Yeah, I thought the twinkle would keep him distracted. These motherfuckers are kind of pissing me off. I know, like, go do something with yourself. I wonder if we could shoot them both and get away with it. I mean, I guess we could coin them to make them turn and then... Like, oh, yeah, the yeah, that's, guy. you're right. Yeah, that's the way we should do it. I was thinking that our, our coin was on cooldown, but even if it was, we could have just waited. Oh, well, we gotta wait for these these boys. Uh, Look at the way they walk, and it's like they're walking down a, a runway. I know, a little bit. Mm-hmm. Strutting their shit. Male models. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, they don't look like serious guards. <laughs> look at them go. It is like a runway. Mm-hmm. Lots of these. All right, so we're gonna wait till they get out of our little circle. Coin them. Get the knife out. Poncho them. <laughs> get back in the oh, bush. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> so we're gonna have to leave his body there, essentially. Yeah. Okay. I was hoping I could get over to the body. I guess we do need to get our knife back, but... That's fine. We'll, we'll go over there once we'll everybody's gone. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so coin. We're gonna coin him. And Come then, to make sure I do this the most efficiently, we're going to, uh... Eyes on the target. Uh, no, I'm trying to... Trying to kill that guy. <laughs> huh. Yeah, there we go. So how far can we get and then stab him? There goes. There we go. Execute. Watch and learn. I said execute. Oh, it, okay. Execute. There we go. So we'll go in here. They'll see that. Let's hope they don't come and look in this bush. We won't save it. Since we don't know if they're going to look in this bush. There's a lot of cursing. They got Filthy mouths. How dare they? Yeah, the most beautiful poncho you've ever done seen. <laughs> Such a pretty poncho. Oh, they are looking in bushes. They found it at a, a flea market. Yep, they're giving up. <laughs> Good job. We didn't find a murderer, but. Like, how did we really like poncho that much? Not really. He's always bragging about his poncho. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about how nice oh, his poncho was. He's up there now, though. What dude? That there? dude was always there. Uh, that was the one that we couldn't get. And it seemed like see. he like turned around or something once. All right, so we need to get the knife back, and that'll be somewhat tricky, but I think we should be able to get it. Uh, I don't know if this guy turns. He doesn't. He's off. We'll just assume. The meaning we'll just assume life. that he doesn't turn. Oh no. Wondering when we he's got the models. Get to have a wedding. Mm-hmm. He's like, I wonder if Sheila will take my hand in marriage. I wonder if she'll like my purple shirt. Oh, we should probably save it. Like, I know I'm just a thug. <laughs> <laughs> but 
I'll be good to keep my head down. All right, so we need to mark this guy so I can see where the uh business. We didn't see shit. <laughs> and so the question is, can we get in, up here into the bushes? Into the bush. You can. You can. So we're in the bush. We can't oh, take out that guy models. though. So we need to use the coin to take out this guy after the models I leave. Lots of these. I don't know if the rest of them can see why while, while I go Do up we there. Need to quick save? Yeah, we should. <laughs> We should always quick save. So we'll throw the coin, distract the guy, and hopefully that'll give us enough time to climb up it. Or we could look. stab him in the face. No, the other guys will see that, Jinx. Oh. What's that noise? What's that? What's that noise? You didn't see shit. Let's get out of here. Oh, there's guys in there. <laughs> I'm trying to stab him. I got a guy on my shoulder, though. Oh. You can totally stab a dude with another dude on your shoulder. Yeah, we don't know from experience anything, guys, <laughs> but but I can tell you that you most definitely can do that. I mean, it's hard. You're like, come here so I can stab you. <laughs> <laughs> I think I rushed in there so quickly, forgetting True. that they can't see me when I'm there. Oh, yeah, if you're crouching. Yeah, I just got worried. Huh? They'd see me. All right, there we go. Okay, so this time, let's be more careful. And we'll go ahead and quick save this shit. Alright, so they're going... He's going down that way. So where are we trying to get to? Oh, we gotta get to her. Alright, so I think Jinx is just saying that our time is up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, just about. I suppose we can try and get through here and not enact the cutscene, but just get through this section and kill these two guys real quick. Yeah, that's what we'll do real quick, because I think we did start the recording a little minute later, or whatever. So we got about another minute or so, guys. See what we can do. Yeah, we'll see what we can do in one minute. So we're going to let that guy walk. Pretty cool. Come in here. Kill this dude. Doing all right for himself. Shove him Something's in the closet. I don't know how they don't see the blood that's all over the ground. But we'll will. shove him in the closet. Yeah. Won't be able to take that guy out, but we don't need to. Of course. So, at this point, we just need to wait for him to walk down, come here, miss his buddy, look for his buddy. Well, the blood does disappear. It does. It's magical blood. Please. Kate, this is not Such the language mm -hmm. for a lady. I know, right? It's not very lady. Like on her wedding day. So yeah, he's looking for this guy now. Where'd he go? The first place he looked is on the couch. Did he take a nap? Uh oh. Oh, I didn't expect him to come out here. Okay. Uh oh. I didn't expect that to happen. And yeah, we can't kill him. We should have went in the building and killed him. Yeah, I guess we should have. Yeah, we should have. Just need to calm down a bit. Okay, I wasn't even thinking about him possibly <laughs> coming out here. I just thought Me he would neither. just. I guess that's smart though, him to come out here because that's where he would go. True. Maybe he went for a smoke break. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, he dies too now because of that. Shove him in the closet too. Yep, they can be in the the closet together. All right. So I don't know if these guys can see through the window. I don't think so. Sweet. All right, I don't think anybody oh, can see here. There's that dude, but he's busy. All right. Oh, I was gonna save it right there. It looks like we're watching the cutscene. It's done. Nothing I can do now. Call him back. Kate, please. We have a wedding ahead of us. Now calm down, will you? Time's wasting. You really still think I was going to marry you? Enjoy your wedding. Uh, not so fast! You have no idea how much I've invested in this. You will marry me today. You're going to play the good little wife. And I bet you'll forget all about your old life after you pop out a few children. Tempting, but I must decline. What the hell are you doing, Kate? Just trying to be convincing. Oh. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going to show you your place in this world, you stupid... I think I know my place. I reckon he deserved that. 
Who the hell are you? I could ask you the same. I don't have time. Step aside. <laughs> really? To the office! Move it! You sure you want to go this way? Shit! What the shit? Open the fucking door! Here, take this. <sighs> Case closed. Okay, what now? The balcony door? Works for me. What are you doing? He doesn't need that money anymore. Money, huh? Heads down. Right. Close call. They're gonna search everywhere now. I have to warn my uncle. Let's get out of here. Well, tell me something first. You ever heard of a guy called Frank? Yeah. Let's discuss it on the way, if you don't mind. No chance we'll get through there. Not without some serious firepower. You know how to pull the trigger of a Gatling gun? I sure do. But, um, why does it have a pink ribbon? It's a wedding present. Don't ask. Anyway, I don't think I'll get very far in this bloody dress. Let's visit that maid up on the stage. I can steal her clothes and use them to blend in. Sure. Though, I don't see a gal like you blending in anywhere, Miss, uh... O'Hara. Kate O'Hara. I'll take that as a compliment, Mr... Uh, Cooper. John Cooper. Ah, you'll take care of it. All right. So, we don't need a quick save because we're going to regular save here. And uh, this is where we're in the episode with, uh... We got two characters. We need to get her some... Some uh, change of clothes, which from my understanding, that's like her specialty. That's what she does. She blends in. Yeah, she blends in. I'm an invisible woman. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nobody sees her. Or they see her, they don't give it, they don't give a shit, like, basically. Oh, it's a woman. <laughs> Just a woman. Nothing to worry about. Uh, so, yeah, we'll have to get out of here. Uh, I'm excited about playing with another character, though, and checking out her skills and seeing how they operate. All right, so we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video. Subscribe to our channel. And hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our content. Uh, I do hope to see you on the next episode, which remember will not be until Tuesday. Uh, so we'll see you on that video, and thanks for watching, guys.